Okay, this is the Hammond organ that I've been talking about. It's the Hammond XP2 model. Um, I'll just give you a quick overrun. Here are the, this is the exterior of it. I mean, the the final or the finish here is in like perfect shape, pretty much. There's a couple scratches here, a little bit of dings. Um, there is also some peeling on this side. Um, you can see right there. Maybe you could fix that with some glue but there are some parts that are just missing entirely. <coughs> um, the modulation on here is loose, like that, you see. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to snap back, but I'm not sure. The pitch shifter works, uh, it works fine. All the um, knobs here are functioning, obviously. Um, all the buttons turn on, turn off when you start it up. Um, the reverb and the volume those both work. I'll show you that in a moment. The side here on the finish is completely missing. You can't really tell unless you really like look at it. As for the back, you have a plug-in for the Leslie right there. You have your MIDI inputs, your pedals, your line in, your line outs, your sends, your headphones. Um, your tone for the bass and for the treble, foot switch, and midis right there, as well as display contrast, which I'm not ex exactly sure what that is. And you have a power cord, it's plugged in with a standard computer power cord, um, and the power on. Um, okay. The power cord that I'm using has a bit of a, a damage in it, it's not, let me see if I can find it. Oh. Anyway, it's not affecting the wires itself, so it does get power. I'm plugging this into a Fender front and 212R amplifier, uh, going directly, well, I'm going into the power in, but it doesn't matter whether I put it in the inputs or the power in, you still get that same clicking sound that I was talking about. So let's turn it on and I'll show you uh, what we're talking about. So. Power on, click, and you get this little welcome intro thing here. Hammond XP C minus. Okay, so we should be good. There we go. Clicky. So, when I have all of these in, I don't get any sound, I don't get any click. But as soon as I pull it out, one, I get a click. Now, the click is consistently powerful. So, Let's put this down right here. Can you see all these? So I'm holding two notes to make a chord or a minor chord or whatever. And I'm going to start pulling these out as we go. All the sounds work, but you still have a click. I don't know where the click is coming from. I get a distorted sound. I don't get a click anymore, but I get a distortion. I'm gonna turn the volume down because that's pretty piercing. Now we're back at the click when we go a little bit down here. One more click. So I'll go up the scale. get a message removing the second percussion third vibrato Leslie fast which I'm assuming is to speed up the amplifier of the Leslie but I'm honestly don't know you have all of your um, edits your 
<clears throat> saves. I'm not percussion foot switch. I'm assuming, I don't know exactly how these go exactly, but um, I'm pretty sure that you can set it up so you'd have like a percussion on there or something. Um, the reverb works. I'll crank that. I mean, you can definitely hear the reverb is working. The volume works. But that clicking is consistent. So if you know how to fix the click or any other problems with it, please let me know. And thank you very much for watching. Alrighty, have a good one and hope you enjoyed the video. I hope this was very informative. Have a good day.